What's good, ladies and gentlemen? It's your boy Shem T, and I bring you some juicy information. All right, so please hit the subscribe button, like, comment, share. Let's get to 30k subscribers, guys. Let's get to 30k subs. So, as you all know, uh, Caldenero was featured on a song by Drama King. The song was titled Pass I Tell You Back. So, um, on this song, on this particular song, uh, Caldenero did not fail to mention Sakodie's name. Said uh, 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 Namide drives Sakodie. So, um, that is not even the juicy part of the song. Now, the juicy part is that um, d during the reactions, under the comment sections, um, lots of Sakniti fans left comments talking about the beat of this song belongs to Sakodie. Alright, so um, let's go in the comment section and see what they're talking about. So, Atras J said, um, this voice over, the instrument is Sakodi's own as onto beats from Sak. And um, yeah, there were a couple of um, uh, comments under the same one. So, uh, let's go. There are a few. Now, when I, um, when I first received these messages in my DMs on IG, on, on Twitter, on WhatsApp, I decided to do a little uh, research because before you put out any content, you should do some research, all right? So, yeah. Um, Yolex GH said, this is Sakodi's instrument. Um, now, uh, we we have another person, Apollo Didimo, saying, this is King Sakodi's song, Fasoho, about four years now, but Kao couldn't kill the beat, Okay. Um, Rati F. Tampama Video Trailer Legacy Record says that was Sakodi's beat, Kao Jamon. Yet Kao is claiming niggas are copying everything he does. Ironic. I'm guessing there's going to be a lot of fight under this comment. Um, so he asked me to check out Fasoho. Now, I'm not going to play the beats for you guys to hear. That's because of copyright claims. I got a copyright for this song. I got a copyright uh, claim for this particular song. So if I play the beats, I don't think I, I think I might get the copyright claim. I don't want that. So, yeah, um, lots of these comments, lots of these comments. Um, let me look for one more. Let me look for one more. Let me look for one more. So look how Cardinari is so happy rapping on his, on Sakodi's beats. A so-called big artist for that matter, Mister Mister Asion T. That's Sakodi Fasoho beat. Now there were lots of these comments, guys. Lots of these comments. So to clear any ambiguity, I decided to put in some effort. All right, and um. Uh, check for myself. Now, there is some sort of um, a confusion because um, the, during the song, during the song, while if you, if you listen to the song, there was a comment like uh, Mike Jean on the beat, like that was uh, the, the sound. That's what um, should I say? The beat producer said Mike Jean on the beat, so it gives the impression that he created the beat. All right. So, but if you listen to uh, Fasoho, like uh, we were asked to, then you find that um, you let's 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 go to now. You find that um, uh, Sakodi has the same exact beat. Now I decided to do um a little research, and we found that two other people apart from Caldenero have used this um beat. Two other, uh, two other people apart from Caldenero, that's Sakodi and Kikili Sika Boy. Kikili Sika Boy. Did a song, um, dropped an album in 2018, and the album uh, had a song on it that was called, um, let's check, that was called, uh, uh, let me check again. It was called Kutu Wogbo or something like that. I may have modeled the pronunciation. So that this was done in 2018. All right. And on YouTube, um, the, the beat is registered to him also. The beat is registered to him also. Right, if you check under this um channel that this channel that uploaded for a whole animation video, this the beat itself is credited to Kikilisika Boy. All right, this was in 2019. However, Sakodi's own song, uh, well, uh, I think it was it said it was 2016, right? 2016, Sakodi's own song, Fasoho, and uh, is also licensed to him, it's also um, the copyright also belongs to him here. Said license to YouTube by ASCAP Downtown Music Publishing and Five Music Rights Societies. So the point is, 
the point is, the first person we know so far that has that used this beat was Sakodi. All right. Um, the next person we know that used the beat was Keke Lisika Boy. And then um, Drama King of the Black Leo, right? So I believe he's on the Black Leo because he screamed out Black Leo affiliations a couple of times. And people in the comment section, yeah. So, now, my thought is this. My theory is this. It is possible that um, uh, this was done as a... As a it, no, it's possible that this was an oversight. I, I don't know. I don't know how that is possible, all right? If the beats... If they did not create the beat, then they got the beat from somewhere. Now, um, um, it is also possible that uh, Caldenero spat those lines on that particular beat as a way to um, slight Sakodie. All right, it is possible. It is possible. But those are my thoughts. Those are my thoughts. Let me know what you think, guys. Let me know what you think. As far as we know. The person who used this beat first was Sakodi, but the beat is licensed to two different people. All right, it has um two different people on YouTube, Kekelisika Boy and um Sakodi. Or Sakodi was the first. So please let me know your thoughts, guys. God bless.